In this quick little movie, I just want to talk about zooming and navigating uh, inside your image in Photoshop. Uh, if I'm looking at the image down here um, of the old man, I said before that you get some information up here in this little panel in the tab that's just above it that tells us what image we're working on, and it says it's at 66%. The other place to look down here is this little tab down here. It says 66%. That, that'll give us some more information about, about um, how zoomed in we are right there. Um, again, if I want to zoom in on my image, I can do it a number of different ways. There's a zoom tool right here on the, key, on the uh, toolbar, and it looks just like the zoom tool or the magnifying glass that we use. And the shortcut key, of course, is Z on the keyboard. So if I want to go from the marquee tool M, which is up here, down to Z in the keyboard, I can go ahead and click on the zoom tool. When you apply the zoom into the image, what happens is as you click, the image will get larger within the window. If you want to zoom back out, there's two things to do. If you want to zoom out really quickly, you do Command-0, and that will be fit on screen. So it'll get you almost to 100%. If I take the zoom tool and I zoom in and in and in, this way. I can zoom around the image using the scroll bars on the side. There's a scroll bar on the top and the bottom. I can also hold the space bar and that turns my cursor, no matter what tool I'm in, into a hand tool where I can move around incrementally. Or when I let go of the space bar, it turns back into the magnifying uh, little magnifying glass. If I hold the Alt key, I notice that the plus sign turns into a minus sign. Once it turns into a minus sign, if you go ahead and click, you can zoom out in small increments instead of going all in with the zoom this way. So I can zoom back out. Another way to zoom is to take the magnifying glass and keep moving it across the image and it'll turn into A zoomed image. But there is something um, as you're zoomed in you can move around a, a little bit easier in what's called the navigator palette. And if I go up to window and I go up to navigator, by the way this window all of these are just panels that aren't opened yet. Imagine that. So much we don't know about Photoshop already. So if I go into the navigator and I notice, I'll make the navigator a little bigger just for demonstration purposes, I notice that the navigator panel sort of corresponds to um, the area of the picture that I'm in. So if I go ahead and I move the navigator panel this way, if I move that red box, I can go ahead and see my image zoomed. I can also use this little scroll bar over here to zoom in on the screen. But what happens with um, beginning students in Photoshop is Sometimes when you're zoomed in this way, you think somehow you've lost your image. If you ever get zoomed in like this and you don't really know where you are, simply do Command-0 and that will get you back out. So don't get too nervous about zooming and panning in and out.